Right, let's talk a bit of football. Some big games coming up. Mm -hmm. Um, All on TalkSport. We've got you covered across the TalkSport network, obviously. Mm -hmm. Uh, Leicester versus Chelsea is our it's our big kickoff yeah. early kickoff 12.30 mm-hmm. your team mm-hmm. um, how are you looking into that one it's going to be a tough, tough game tough game yeah and not going into this uh, with um, any other preconceived ideas that it's going to be a hard, hard fought game the, the, the one thing is that Leicester are going through a little bit of a, a patch at the moment Arsenal battered it was 2-0 but Arsenal were was so good on the day I mean it was 2 but it could have been 3 or 4 mm. they, were, they were that they were that much better than Leicester and you think they are capable of throwing in a stinker. Soy and Chu has not been to the level that he was since Maguire's left no, for United. No, he's not, he wasn't. He's not, he's not reached those heights. So this is a game, if you catch Leicester on, on the right day and Chelsea perform to the level they can, then Chelsea will win. But I'm not I'm not so sure. I think that this is, it feels like this is going to be a, it wouldn't surprise me if this is a draw. Do you think Chelsea are looking like they're going to be champions? They're a machine, aren't they? Well, we're, we're not, we're not, we're, t- we're top of the table without being convincing. We've oh. not, I've not come away from too many games think, going, wow, that was... Do you know what? Oddly enough, actually, the game against Burnley, we should have wiped the floor of Burnley. We just couldn't finish them. Couldn't finish them. And they hung in there and they hung in there and then Deutsch Do- Do- made a change. He went to a 4-3-3 on about an hour just after that ball. Jay Rodriguez on and they went, they went a little bit more direct. And they, they, in the end, you could say they probably deserved a point the way that he, he went about the game. Yeah, we're un, we're not convincing at the moment. That's the one thing I'll say about Chelsea. We're picking up points. We're top of the table. We keep a lot of clean sheets. Boom, you know, against Brentford, right? We could have drawn that game. Mm. You know, had it not been for Mendy on the day, we 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 could have dropped points on that day. There's been a lot of those games. Southampton played really well against us. They went down to ten men. It was one one when 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 Ward Prowse got sent off. That could have been very different. The whole, yeah, there's a lots of even Aston Villa. Aston Villa played really well at our place. We beat them three 0 They they were they were well in the game. So mm. they, so we are a machine, but we're not. We're we're getting results without being totally convinced. I look at Liverpool, and Man City. I think they're playing better than Chelsea right now. Right now, but we don't keep, concede many goals. What about Leicester? I mean, Leicester they're, they're, they're sitting in twelfth. They've got fifteen points, but mm. they've had a few decent results and good performance, but not yeah. consistent enough. Yeah. What do you make of the whole? Brendan Rodgers to Manchester United saga that seems to be well, his name happening. Always, yeah, it always seems to get linked. He's come out and said he's, you know, he's not real, so I'm not going to answer it. But <laughs> yeah, he, it, it might, it, you know, there, there is obviously say, talk. He's got to say that, hasn't he? Yeah, of course you he's know, got to say that. They're, they're, do you think United? Do you think he's an upgrade from Oli Gunnar Solskjaer? He's an upgrade, but I don't know whether he's a right now a, enough, a big enough upgrade. I don't know whether it's that. <gasps> Oh wow, we got Brent. Do you know? I think yeah. Brendan's done a brilliant job at Leicester. So that, this season's really tough because if you remember over the last, why is two he not se- an upgrade though, Cundy? I he mean, is an upgrade, but he's not enough. But of an why upgrade. is he not? Because he's a, he, he's done exceptional he at Leicester. Yes, he yes, he but so how has he not a bigger, a huge upgrade from Ole Gunnar Solskjaer? Because I think United fans will probably feel as though they want someone with a little bit more. Experience of winning, maybe, maybe a tight. Okay, don't. Like Antonio up Conte, self. yeah, but Spurs have got him because we're a bigger club. Well, Antonio Conte for me is a bigger upgrade. Oh, it's a huge upgrade. That, that that's the sort of that's the sort of manager that that, that many night fans should feel excited about. But you know, that's <laughs> Ollie is still there. He's, Ollie is still he's there. Still there, and hanging they, in there. They play Watford. <laughs> yes, they do. Uh, when, when do they play? Well, they're playing on Saturday. They got mm-hmm. Watford away at three o'clock. Yeah. Uh, be around the grounds of Adrian Durham that one yeah. it's a it's a huge game that a huge that, game that, and it's not going to be an easy one because Ranieri is going to think I fancy this Man United win that game mate do you think yeah they do they just got better players they got they they, they all win that game yeah, they're away from home coming back it, from an international break they, look Players have picked yeah, up injuries. Yeah, you can build it all you like about a way... Oli Gunnar Solskjaer gets the sack mate, after Saturday. Mate, let me tell you, how how much Oli, Oli can dig out these little results like this where you look at it and think, oh, that's a bit... United will win that game. They will. They this won't, is they, one they, they have to dig out. If, if I'll tell you what, this is the question I ask. If they don't win this game, if they draw this game, does he get the sack? Um, he should get the sack. I don't know whether he gets the sack... But what it could do, depending on other results, it could take them right down to mid-table. And that doesn't look good. No. So it might not just be the... Re- if they get beaten, well, that's a that's enormous. 
That's enormous. Yeah, they, I just cannot see that. How can you get beaten by a side that's fighting relegation, even after 11 games? Mm. No, that's, United will get a result here. United will win this one. They'll, they'll have too much. United fans, give us a call. 03717 Big game for you at the weekend. How are you feeling? Uh, is Oli Gunnar Solskjaer at the wheel still? You want to keep him there for a longer period? Or Brendan Rodgers or Zidane? Could you take him? Give us a call. Let us know. This is Sports Bar on TalkSport with me, Jeremy High, Jason Cundy. 